doing elastic shearing on a Sears Kenmore 1803 vintage sewing machine. I'm just doing a straight stitch. My setting is eight for my stitches per inch, uh, and it's set for a straight stitch. And I have tightened my tension. See, it's down to six, and that is giving me these beautiful shearings. Um, and that's elastic thread on the back. You just wind, wrap the elastic thread around your bobbin and uh, do, not, do not stretch it while you're winding it around the bobbin. Um, when you have a full bobbin, then you can start shearing. Um, but it's the combination of the longest stitch length and the tight tension with the elastic thread in the bobbin and regular thread on top. That is what creates yards and yards of beautiful shearing. The rolled hem was done on a baby lock serger. It's a two thread rolled hem with a beautiful cord like uh, embroidery thread. I will attempt to take a few stitches of the shearing um, one handed here for you just so you can see in here as it's working. Hard part is trying to keep myself sewing straight, especially one handed. I'm not great at one handed sewing. Anyway, I do love how it's turning out. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, this is the ninth row of shirring, and I have a whole bunch of little ruffles I'm going to be showing on the skirt, too. Again, more 1803 elastic shirring.